The live look in Sacramento right there from our Holiday in Downtown Arena camera. A lot of gas guzzlers out in the road, no doubt, but a new law designed to end the sale of gas and diesel vehicles could make the Golden State a whole lot greener. CBS 13's Lamore Abrams is live in Sacramento with uh, what's driving this proposal. Lamore? Tony, Democratic lawmakers say they want to cut emissions that lead to climate change. The state is already ramping up production of electric car charging stations like this one behind me. Now, the state is trying to get the rest of us to ditch our gas-powered car habit. Nothing revs up Alan Chen more than his 1974 Alfa Romero GTV. With modern cars, it's just you don't really feel the roll as much. But his fancy ride may soon be sidelined as California accelerates its push for an all-electric future. It's time for bold action in California. Arnie Sowell of the environmental advocacy group Next Gen America is pushing a bill that bans fossil-fueled cars. By 2040, all new passenger cars sold in the Golden State would be green, free of emissions. Dirty cars, uh, dirty trucks, dirty school buses. Uh, actually are the largest emitters of uh, greenhouse gas emissions uh, in California. This mechanic isn't ready to switch gears quite yet. It still takes a bunch of emissions to make new cars. But his partner Frank Fiddler is gearing up for an electric car future. For one thing, they're much simpler. Uh, they don't require transmissions. The components are much fewer. It's just going to get better and better. But what would the incentives be for electric car buyers like this one here? Lawmakers haven't gotten into the details yet. But in countries like Norway that have switched over, there are incentives. People who own electric cars, they get to drive in bus-only lanes. And in some cases, they can even dodge parking tickets, I'm told. Tony? Interesting concept, and we'll see how it plays out, Lamore. Thanks for that live update.